Good morning, everyone. This is 12 News Meteorologist Stephen Matragrano here with a Weather Now update for you on this very cold Thursday morning. Looking outside at Providence, we have dry conditions and mostly clear skies. Same deal here in Newport. Good visibility as well. Uh, but the main story this morning will be those temperatures. It's very cold out there. Temperatures in the 20s, but it feels like the teens when you factor in the wind. So radar is quiet. No snow out there, but I am tracking a uh, Clipper system, an Alberta Clipper, that's going to be making its way uh, into our area later on this evening, give us in, uh, giving us a few hours of some snow, and it looks to be on the light side, but the system is currently across the Great Lakes region. You can see that kind of uh, shield of precip there, of some rain and snow, and uh, we'll be seeing that uh, parts of it kind of clip our area later on tonight. So temperatures now, like I said, in the 20s. Feels like the teens in spots, even down to the coastline. It feels like 12 in Newport, feels like 13 in Providence. So for the rest of this morning, looking at bright skies, temperatures rising through the 20s, and we'll be just around freezing by lunchtime. But a very cold day. Again, keep in mind that wind will make things feel a little bit colder at times. But we should be dry during uh, much of the day with bright skies continuing this afternoon. But we'll be seeing increasing clouds. I'm thinking by about 3 or 4 o'clock this afternoon, We'll see more clouds uh, take over. And again, no precip uh, during the afternoon hours, but the clouds will win out and temperatures topping out in the middle 30s. So for tonight, again, that period of some light snow during the evening hours, I'm thinking around, you know, 7, 8, 9, 10 o'clock, that range there uh, for a period of light snow that could bring, you know, some light accumulations. But regardless, we're going to be seeing clearing and drying out uh, late at night and temperatures bottoming out in the upper 20s to near 30. So here's the snow map that we have. Again, this is not a big deal by any means. Most of this does fall in a few hours, and it's during the uh, evening hours, so many people will probably be home by then. I'm um, looking at a coating to an inch in that white area along the coastline, maybe an inch or two uh, you know, further north, and uh, I think that's being generous, honestly. So not a big deal by any means, but still plan for... Uh, you know, some flakes to be flying later on tonight because, of course, as we all know, it only takes a little bit of snow uh, to cause some issues on the roadways. So uh, be mindful of that later on today. But other than that, things looking good as we go into Friday. Bright skies, chilly temperatures once again, and breezy conditions and blustery conditions. Northwest winds 15 to 25 miles per hour, but gusts as high as 35. Those feels like temperatures will be a lot colder than the actual air temperatures. So that's your latest Weather Now update. Thank you for tuning in, and we'll talk to you soon. Take care.